at the Talia Field. 12 laps on the board. On the line is Steel Fabricators lap counter. Our final event of night one of the Monk and Son Ag Services Australian Formula 500 Championship. Field set, 12 laps are racing, and we're green and underway. Michael Coe down the low side, down on the inside. He's your race leader, count number 59. Then back to Paul Verhoeven, who's looking to try and find a way around. Oh, that's a massive rollover. Wow. Was that Corey de Glock? No, it wasn't. It was that. Was that Corey de Glock? No, it wasn't. It was that. Who was that? Oh, it's how it's how it's Stansfield. That was. Uh... Outside Paul Verhoeven, then back to Corey de Glides and Paul Singleton as the field makes its way down the back straight for the first time. So, Code is your race leader, then there's about a three car, make that four car gap between first and second, back in second position. It's Paul Verhoeven. So, Verhoeven, and about to come under a bit of pressure because right behind him, it's the 22 car of Corey de Glides. Back in fourth, still Paul Singleton. A spin down the back with a 73 car of Paul Baker. Manages to keep going and we stay green. Michael Code now starting to open up that lead over Paul Verhoeven. So Michael Code doing a, a nice job as he comes out of turn number four once again. And this time there's seven laps remaining on the line of steel fabricators. I'll have counter here at HP Stockfeed Simpson Speedway. Verhoeven back in second, back in third, Corey Deglides, then Paul Singleton, then back to Jared Mabbitt. They were followed by Sally Wollstonecroft and rounding out the field car, number 73, Paul Baker. So the 59 car of Michael Code comes around through turn number four and has five laps to go, so half race distance for Michael Code. Uh, Michael Code making it look relatively easy out there at the moment, Benny. As he comes up onto the back marker, once again a Paul Baker. Certainly is. Four laps to run for Michael Code in the Simpson 59. Looking strong out in front. Paul Verhoeven in the Waterville 5 sits back in second. Back to Corey de Glides, who's a long way back in third. Paul Singleton further back to Jared Mabbitt and Sally Wollstonecroft at the tail of field. The 73 car of Paul Baker really starting to slow down around the pole line. But up in front, your race leader is Michael Code, and he's making it look easy out in front in the Simpson 59. Heads through three and four once again in the Simpson 59, and he'll come across with two laps remaining here. Ahead of the Waterville 5 of Paul Verhoeven, further back to Corey de Glides in the 22. They want to hurry because it's starting to rain again. Absolutely. Two laps, one lap this time round. The white flag will drop out for Michael Code. And Michael Code on his last circulation here from Paul Verhoeven, Corey Deglides, Paul Singleton, back to Jared Mabbitt, Sally Wollstonecroft. 
but up in front, your race leader, your feature winner in the Super Odds on night one of the Formula 500 Australian Championship is Michael Coe. Takes it from Paul Verhoeven in the Waterball 5. The 22 of Corey DeGlatis ahead of Paul Singleton and Jared Mabbott. Sally Wollstonecroft at the Talia field with Paul Baker. That rain looks serious out there just at the moment. It does look quite serious. We've uh, been blowing a gale here for a few minutes now and it's blown up some uh, trade off. Wow, we'll actually, we'll see you back here tomorrow night, 6 o'clock start. Oh boy. For our uh, night two of our Australian Championship for the Formula 500s. Looking forward to having you all here. No presentations tonight, Gary, so we'll uh, won't be.